Hello, so welcome to First Little Drawing Techniques video. Um, just tiny little things to help you on your way if you're starting out, if you just really want to do something to do when you've never drawn before. I'm going to start at the beginning, give you a few little exercises. Um, these are things we use at art school to learn to draw, and they're not about drawing a flower or a person or a thing or any object. It's learning the techniques that you translate to anything. So it's a really good way to start to learn to draw. The first one is outline drawing. So this is outline drawing and this is what this is here. And we've used two objects. You'll have these in the kitchen, um, a little pot of some kind and a bottle. See, they're two different shapes. One is tall, long, one little bit more spot. You can use something else. You could use a cup if you don't have a pot. The reason I've used this is because it's coloured so you can see the outline. If I put a white cup there, it's a bit more difficult to see, but you can use whatever you've got. Try and use things that don't have heavy pattern and I put something blank behind it. It just stops your eye from being distracted by what's going on behind. Also, we don't have this to the side or here with no gap here. We want it in front and touching. You see that? You see that? that? It's touching that, but it's in the front. So the object of this is that these two things are becoming one. Uh, because if you're starting out to draw, uh, the instinctive thing would probably be to draw around this and then kind of move over and draw around that, somehow fit them together. Uh, and lots of little accidents start to happen when you do that very, at the very beginning. Um, so outline drawing is where we assume the whole mass as one thing. So we've got this, I'll show you this. So this is my outline drawing from before. So I've just started at any point, maybe the top of the bottle or the bottom, and I've just really drawn around the whole thing. So I'm going to do that again. I'm going to do it while you're watching me so you can see what I'm doing. This here. Um, I'm using a marker pen just so you can see a bit better what I'm doing. So I'm going to start here and I'm going to go right around the outside. I'm going to come to here. When I come to here, I just come across. I'm just going to ignore these details. Ignore that. I'm just going for the big shape. Back and over. So you'll see I start at where, where I think. It's just a guesstimate. It's a rough drawing. Nothing to be too careful about, but I'll come down, down, down. Then I've got to the edge of the bottle. When my eye comes to the edge of the bottle, the little pot starts to take over, but it's in front because it's coming down. So the shape is down here. So I bring this down and come back across and go up again. Whoops, take the pen up again. Then I'm coming to the bottle, come back up there, come all the way up there. So you can see what I've done. It's very quick, so it's not quite as accurate as this one. Um, so you may take a couple of minutes to do it. But if I show you that in front of the composition here. So we haven't got any detail. I haven't stopped. Don't stop when you're doing this to go into detail here or start sketching or fiddling. To get the real, to get out of this exercise what it can give you. Just go around the outline and do it a few times. And you're just getting the two shapes together. So what the object of that is, is I'll show you just a little example here. I'm just going to bring this bit closer so you can see it. Um, so what we've got here is, here's something that you might do if you did them separately. So what might happen is this gets a bit taller, this gets a bit smaller, or the opposite, this gets a bit exaggerated, this gets a bit smaller. Uh, so outline drawing is here, and somehow it distracts us from this separation and we put them together we get more accurate proportion then you just pick up the line from the edge and bring those two together I'll show you how to do that so you're at the edge here you've got this going on I'll show you here and then you would go back look at the composition and just pick up the line of that where that little pot was you can alter that obviously that's not quite right so we'd alter it a bit then we just have a look at it, and it's very important to move away from your drawings, at least arms length. At least arms length. Away. And then you may look at it, and you see if you think the proportions are good. It's an exercise. It's a good way to do it. Try it the first way, maybe, and then try it with an outline. And try your outline drawing a few times. It's not something that you sit in front of with one piece of paper for half an hour and get it perfect. Get five or six pieces of copy paper. Do it very quickly, two minutes, do it again, do it again. That's how we learn. So I hope that will be useful, at least fun to try. 
and I'll see how you're getting on with it. See you later.